It's a metamorphosis of the city and the beginning of a new area, a new period. And my grandfather was the only son of CEO, and CEO was the brother of Vincent van Gogh, who made possible to Vincent van Gogh to be an artist. I'm uh, the artist of this room. Uh, maybe you see that it's a Van Gogh's room, and then you can color it. About, about okay, Vincent, what would he think about it? And I think he would be very, very happy to, to be of such influence still, 125 years after his death, to modern artists that he still inspires, which his painting of, of the bedroom in Arnhem. He stayed two years in Mons, in Mons area. The exhibition examines the uh, roots of Van Gogh in the Borinage and what it means for subsequent years. What is for me very important, we found an early drawing, an unknown where it was for many decades. We did find it back in a small museum in Japan, the Uehara Museum in Shimoda. And it is now here and it is next to a copy he made later in Saint Remy in 1889. Cottages are a motive that was really very important for Van Gogh. He loved those humble dwellings in which the people that he liked to portray lived in. Another highlight is obviously the work from the Athenaeum Museum in Helsinki, which we were very, very glad to get, because it's one of the highlights of his, the last weeks of his life. Van Gogh inspires every day many people <coughs> around the world, and his inspiration is still alive. <laughs> Water made um, beautifully uh, come alive with uh, egg lights and uh, beautiful colors. Um, the fight of uh, Saint George of, against the dragon, it's, um, it's the fight of the good against the bad. So much uh, work for as the, uh, an exposition like that. If everybody can do the same thing, we can live in a better world. So we're in Mons, it's the European capital of culture. It's three degrees out there. They put hot finish, um, finish hot tubs outside and bring body in. If someone could just bring some champagne. And I appreciate it very much because it's cold outside and inside it's very hot and it feels good. And I think it will be a good sight. Winston Churchill, at the very beginning of the war, he answered to the members of his government, what are we fighting for? It's to emphasize the proximity, worries and hopes between artists and entrepreneurs. Unfortunately, a lot of businessmen consider that culture is not useful. Bringing people together, bringing artists to a closer range with entrepreneurs, is something which is very smart to do. Uh, I'm very proud to represent the, the main sponsor, uh, the private main sponsor is ING Bank in Belgium. It has two senses for us. The first one is to support further art and culture. The second one is to support this region. We are going to open in 2015 uh, five new museums, a new center for music. We have already opened a new theater. This fantastic 
uh, uh, Congress Hall. We are going to open uh, uh, hours for the design. It's the metamorphosis of infrastructure of the city, but at the same time, it's really a metamorphosis of the minds. It's on the way, it's on the good way. And, uh, we use culture also for, to leverage, to have a, a way for more uh, economic growth in the city and in the region. Behind me is the Digital Innovation Valley, integrating uh, the data center of uh, Google, their European data center. We have accelerators with uh, private companies like Microsoft. Uh, moreover, we have one, uh, about 100 uh, startup companies. So we're here at Fishing Cactus, we're in the production room and uh, you can see there's a lot of people here. This is where we make all the games, develop them, test them and uh, make them all for your enjoyment and your entertainment. More than 1,000 uh, high-tech uh, uh, employment, uh, which uh, was really uh, uh, very important for the, the project of European Capital of Culture. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah!